The government has named the free-falling economy and the raging pandemic an act of God. But the facts cannot be denied. Facts prove government's failure long before the pandemic arrived. Unemployment and poverty have hit the nation like never before in last two years. The latest data from National Crime Records Bureau reveal how ill economic management has been claiming lives in India. More than 1.3 lakh suicides were reported in India last year. 8% of these 1.3 lakh were due to unemployment, poverty, bankruptcy, indebtedness collectively. Suicides due to each of these causes saw an increase from 2018. And together, they saw at least one death by suicide each hour in 2019. Out of 11,268 suicides, bankruptcy indebtedness accounted for 52% of such deaths. More than 2,800 people died due to joblessness, while another 2,509 of them died due to poverty. These figures only account for 2019, when the nation was not affected by the devastating pandemic. 2020 has pushed India to massive unemployment and reduction of income. In just one year, from 2018 to 2019, suicides due to poverty jumped over 100%. while bankruptcy-related suicides saw a spike of nearly 200%. Millions of people have lost jobs and businesses in just the last five months. The packages announced by the government brought no relief. GDP going down by minus 23% will make the struggle harder for the people there seems to be no respite from the spiking pandemic, with cases reaching over 82,000 per day. The government's act of ignoring the economy and the pandemic has now left India with no hope. The government, after spoiling both, calls its own act the act of God. Things could have been different. If at all, the government had acted in time.